bleeding. Don't, I'm all right. But you're bleeding. Go away, don't look at me. No! Ah. I don't think it's fair that women have an excuse once a month to act irrationally angry when the rest of us have to keep it together all the time. Females living or working in close quarters could eventually get on the same cycle. <laughs> Whenever you're ready, it happened. Satan's trifecta. I'm gonna fucking throw up. So one period on my fucking leg. Oh shit. What the fuck do I do? I've never before seen that in my life. This is so disgusting. Because of the period stigma that makes menstruation a taboo topic, we don't often think about what it's like for a homeless or low income menstruator to get their period. And we don't have open conversations about period health or the solutions to period poverty. It's time that we change this. More than four in five students, that's 84%, in the U.S. have either missed class time or know someone who's missed class time because they did not have access to period products. 64% of teens who menstruate believe society teaches people to be ashamed of their periods. 69% feel embarrassed when they have to bring period products into the bathroom. And 76% think we are taught more about the biology of frogs than the biology of the human female body. I'm done with that. I'm a lot more candid now. I have dropped the TMI acronym from my vocabulary, and I encourage all of you to do the same thing. Tell everyone that you're on your period just like you would tell them that you have a headache. Everybody has worn the white pants and then gotten them super bloody. Tell your coworkers, I'm off to the gynecologist, as you skip merrily away. Personally, I use a diva cup because I think it's better for the environment. And don't be scared. You just get a little more comfortable with yourself. Be that angel that carries tampons around despite not being someone who uses them. Half the world struggles with these same issues, but we don't talk about it at all, especially males. At first, everyone will be uncomfortable, including you. I would hide it in like a Target bag, like that, like under my sink, and then take it to another place and throw it out. And it was really kind of sad when I look back on it. And I was roller skating and I felt myself get my period, and I didn't really know what to do. So I basically just sat, no tampons, no pads, no nothing. I was really embarrassed about the idea of throwing um, dirty pads in the garbage because I was like, everyone's going to see it. Everyone's going to know that I have my period and that's really weird. So she actually had a bag for me in my luggage to wrap up my used pads and put them in my luggage to bring them home. Because eventually you'll stop being uncomfortable and so will the people that you interact with and that's how we make change. That's how we undermine period poverty. That's how we end shame around menstruation. Hey, hey.